Welcome back, dear listeners, to Whispers of the Shadows. Our investigators are about to descend even deeper into the heart of darkness, where the horrors that await them are beyond imagining. Be prepared for a journey into the unknown. As they begin to slip into madness and face the eldritch forces that surround them. Our feature presentation will begin shortly, so turn down the lights and prepare for a chilling ride. This is your host, signing off and wishing you pleasant nightmares. Will the investigators continue down their path of danger, or will they make a deal with the Elder One? Only time will tell. The investigators stood in silence, contemplating their next move. They knew that the creatures they were facing were powerful and dangerous, and that they were in over their heads. But they also knew that they couldn't let the creatures continue their reign of terror. As they weighed their options, the sky turned an even darker shade of green, and the ground began to tremble. They knew that they had no time to waste. They turned to the Elder One and made their decision. We will make the sacrifice, one of the investigators said. But you must help us defeat these creatures. They threaten the safety of not just this town, but the entire world. The Elder One nodded its head, its eyes gleaming with a dark light. Very well, it said. I will help you, but you must be prepared for the consequences. The sacrifice must be made, and there will be no turning back. The investigators nodded their agreement, and the Elder One led them to an ancient temple hidden deep within the woods. The temple was old and decrepit, but it was clear that it had once been a place of great power. The Elder One instructed the investigators to perform a ritual that would summon the sacrifice. It was a complicated and dangerous process and they knew that there was a chance that it could go horribly wrong. But they had no choice. They needed the sacrifice to summon the power that would help them defeat the creatures. As they performed the ritual, the sky grew darker, and the wind howled through the trees. They could hear the creatures in the distance, their unearthly cries echoing through the night. And then, suddenly, the sacrifice appeared. It was a young woman, barely more than a teenager, and she looked terrified. The investigators hesitated, their hearts heavy with guilt. But they knew that they had no choice. They had made their decision, and they had to see it through. They performed the sacrifice, and the Elder One began to chant. The air grew thick with a dark energy, and the creatures in the distance began to retreat. The investigators knew that they had succeeded. But at what cost? They had sacrificed a young woman's life for their cause, and they couldn't help but feel a sense of overwhelming guilt. As they left the temple, they knew that they had made a terrible choice. But they also knew that they had no choice. The creatures had been defeated, and the town of Arkham was safe once again. The investigators returned to the town of Arkham, their minds still reeling from the events of the past few days. They knew that they had defeated the creatures and saved the town, but at a terrible cost. They couldn't shake the feeling that they had made the wrong choice, that they had sacrificed a young woman's life for their own gain. As they walked through the streets, they could feel the eyes of the townspeople on them. They knew that the people of Arkham were grateful for their help, but they also knew that they were afraid of them. They were the ones who had made the deal with the Elder One, and they were the ones who had made the sacrifice. The investigators knew that they couldn't stay in Arkham any longer. They had to leave, to escape the guilt and the shame that hung over them. They packed their bags and prepared to leave, but before they could go, they received a message. It was a message from the Elder One. It demanded that they return to the temple and perform another sacrifice, this time of their own choosing. The investigators were horrified. They had thought that their deal with the Elder One was over, but it seemed that they were wrong. 
They knew that they had to go back, that they had no choice but to face the consequences of their actions. They returned to the temple, their hearts heavy with dread. The Elder One was waiting for them, its eyes gleaming with a dark light. You have fulfilled your end of the bargain, it said. But there is still one more sacrifice to be made. One of you must offer yourself up to me, in exchange for the power that I have given you. The investigators looked at each other, their faces pale with fear. They knew that they had no choice. They had made a deal with the devil, and now they had to pay the price. And with that, the second chapter of the story ends. Will the investigators sacrifice one of their own, or will they find another way out of their predicament? Only time will tell.